My mind starts wondering, you know, why would somebody do that? Strange crimes in one neighborhood. A thief is targeting people's side view mirrors. New at 7 o'clock, 10 News reporter Michael Chen has the fiery clue that could help crack this case. It's not something Kevin Baynard ever thought would be stolen. On Tuesday morning, when he came out to this Range Rover, it was gone. Anger. For Baynard. Feeling violated. Frustration after an early morning shock. Just come out to my vehicle and I, um, you know, quickly uh, noticed that do a double take. His side view mirror. The wires here are, you know, cut quite nicely. Cleanly removed. Somebody knew what they were doing. Wire by wire. As his SUV sat parked in this lot overnight in University Heights that same night. This is the uh, chart remains. Just feet away, a different vehicle was set on fire. There's a pretty large area here that was uh, torched. When Baynard's wife posted the details of the incident on nextdoor.com. So you got to wonder their pattern here. A neighbor a few blocks away wrote his mirror glass was popped out. <laughs> News reports from Los Angeles detail a series of similar thefts, including a cluster in Burbank last year. While police in San Diego have not noticed a rash of similar crimes. There's a lot of um, questions um, unanswered. Questions like why? Well, the cost of a new mirror is in the six to seven hundred dollar range. But a quick check of eBay reveals a used part can also net nearly four hundred bucks. It's a little it's a little bit of an ouch. That's money Baynard will now have to shell out to replace the mirror, even as he tries to get the word out. Be vigilant on a bizarre crime. We have to support each other. Um, neighbor to neighbor. Michael Chen, 10 years. Police say the mirrors may be a target because there are no parts numbers on them and they can easily be resold. One service manager told us there are no anti theft devices for mirrors, but you may be able to raise the sensitivity level on your alarms to include the mirrors.